<laughs> what I will say about their exchange is yeah. it feels personal. Okay. I, I, we wouldn't know, but that's a fact. I could see that. It feels... Because I got a reaction. Like I don't know. No, I feel you. But yeah. it feels personal. Okay. And going back to what I said, I'm, I'm a fucking student of this game. I can't say it any other way. Mm. I watch everything. I see everything. I have to be informed by everything. This is the advantage that I feel that we have on this podcast is one, just being a student, one, being informed, and just paying attention to the things that everybody may not be paying attention to. One of those things that I was paying attention to is when Charlemagne went through his list, there were some hard edits on certain names. <laughs> you can hear it. Number 13 was a hard edit was for the Brilliant Idiots podcast, which they didn't mention, which was Rory and Maul. What? Right? They went through the list. Charlemagne, Nyla, shout out to Nyla. Wait, they what? went through the shout list. Nyla, yeah. And maybe they did have commentary on number 13, but in their video and in their audio, there was no mention of number 13 at all. Mm. Now, to me, that says, as a producer, putting my producer hat on today, right? Hey. Producer says... Charlemagne either said something he didn't want to go out into the world or he really just had no thoughts on it and he just didn't mention it. Mm -hmm. But let's go a little bit deeper because it's not like he said, hey, number 13 was these guys and kept it pushing. There was literally no mention. It mm -hmm. went from 14 to 12. Mm. But did that happen with any other part of the list? Not like, did in he that skip way. around like we did? No, no, not at all. He went through every other number. That was the only number they didn't say the number this 13. This is interesting. Right? So that's one, which tells me whatever. And the three of them have some background together, right? Yeah, they got some little, background. Little history. Yeah. I think Maul said that the Breakfast Club was going to be over at some point. So Charlemagne, he didn't really take heed to that too right. much. Um, I know Rory was banned, allegedly. I don't know how true it is. But yeah. I think from what the public knows, Rory was banned from the Breakfast Club by uh, DJ Envy at some point. So maybe there is some static there. I don't know. That's not my business, not my place. But I do know from watching The Brilliant Idiots, they didn't mention number 13. And then when we get to number five, Elliot is mentioned and there's a hard cut. Boom. It tells me that something was said and maybe it's a little bit deeper than what it is that we know. 